Hi, welcome. Today I would like to talk about uh, auto fixture package in .NET. Uh, it can be very useful actually if you are trying to do unit testing and integration testing with uh, within C Sharp. So let's get started. I'm basically on the .NET Fiddle. I have installed this package called auto fixture. You can also go to the website auto fixture and I will add a link to my video here but this is the basics of auto fixture so let's get started so once you have the auto fixture you want to be able to test certain objects so to be able to do that what i've done is i've created a public class called book which has a title and a price and then it uh, refers another class called authors and in the author we have a few things so let's see how you would go about using auto fixture to do unit testing and integration testing Typically what you want to do is start with creating a new uh, object and you can just use new fixture. Once you have a fixture, you want to uh, build a particular object from a class. So what you can say is fixture.build and uh, in the generic you can specify the type of object you want to build. In this case we want to build book and let's say we want to just get one object and uh, I'm going to save our um, uh, particular book is equal to this. So it should build me a book object and it will automatically fill in various values uh, for that book object. So you won't have to fill in those values during your unit test. And you can also customize, but I'll go over that. So let's say we do this and we want to just dump uh, what is in this object. And uh, we can run it. And as you can see, this auto fixture created automatically an object of type book uh, where the price was set to some arbitrary value. The title was set to this arbitrary string. And within the author, it also went in inside, inside the book uh, class and filled in some values for that. So basically when you're doing certain unit testing, you only want to fill in the things you're interested in, you could do that. Let's say for a particular example, uh, I wanted to just say that um, for auto fixture, uh, whenever I see a double, I went, I would like its value to be just one. So we, what you can say is fixture dot inject, and you can say double, and you can specify the value. Let's say I'm going to say that whenever auto fixture sees a double, it will put in a value of 1.0. So it's going to do that. So as you can see, that worked. The price was basically set to one. You can do the same thing with strings itself. Let's say if I say fixture dot inject string, and uh, let's say it's going to be got for this moment, and uh, we can run this again, and you can see that every time it encounters a string, it's going to put in the value of got. So that's actually pretty good. For some reason, let's say you wanted uh, this object to have certain attributes, so you can also customize it. And uh, the way to do it is when you're creating this object, uh, you can specify as to how you want to uh, do certain things with it. So I'm going to say with p, let's say p slash p dot uh, title. Let's say we want to uh, put in a title of an awesome book. Uh, so I can do that and uh, it will create in one object of the title and you can see that the title is set to awesome book. So you can also, when you're doing unit testing, you can specify the fields you are interested in with, with and you can also uh, use uh, another attributes, uh, for example, uh, do, for example, if you wanted to run some method or certain things. And it is actually quite useful. See, you can do with do or with. Um, another thing you can do quickly when you're creating objects is instead of creating one object you can create many objects and to do that you can just use create many and usually when you're creating many it creates three objects so you can see it's going to create three objects here one uh, two and then three objects so this is actually pretty good a uh, tool I found that uh, automatically can fill up your objects with certain values and you can add certain customizations. So I would uh, giving uh, giving it a try and it's called the auto fixture. The package is auto fixture. 
and I'll put in the link on my website Gaur Associate under Auto Fixture. Thank you for watching this short screencast and you have a great day.